This ball, uh, journey through an amputation, day 123. Um, it's been uh, today's Saturday. Um, I am watching my grandson play basketball. Hey, buddy. Hey. And we are just enjoying the windy day here in Missouri. Wanted to uh, give you an update on myself. Um, I'm waiting for a new, I got I need a new socket. I went to Hanger Clinic and they measured me and I went way down. They did adjustments on this socket, but I'll show you what they did in a minute. Um, I'm already getting ready to get another one. The, I couldn't get into the, I have to have a prescription to get a new socket. So I have to go back to MU Orthopedics, get a prescription to go back to Hanger Clinic to get it get it done. It's it's whatever ridiculous. But I'm gonna show you where I'm at right now as far as my leg. You guys haven't seen my leg in a while, so I will show you this here real quick and then I'll get to the other issues that I've got going on in my life right now, which is wait, stop. Alright, sorry, my uh grandson the ball rolled out in the street and the car was coming so I had to yell at him real quick. So he actually stopped, listened, um and did what he's supposed to do. So let me show you this leg real quick and I'll uh, put the phone down and start doing that. Alright, so here's my uh, leg and this is the sleeve. And it's a little dirty. I've been gardening today, so it's kind of, I've been on, on all day. It's pretty, uh, pretty dirty and so I'm pulling this thing down. Pull that down and pull that off. Okay, this is what the doctors did, or hanger plant did. I was too small. They put a pad in here and I put a pad here and here behind this Velcro. Hold on, buddy. All right, so there's that, and there's a pad in the bottom to keep the um, my leg from hurting when it hits the bottom. Um, right now I've got, there's the green is three, the five is, the blue is five. I've only got eight layers, and then I got one more on there. So that's another three, so that's 11 layers of socks, even after the adjustment. So, and then I got the gel pad on. Which, give me a second here, I gotta get this thing right away because if you leave it inside out it tends to collect hair and dirt and dust so hold tight all right so here is my nub as it stands now and got a little bit of a heat rash going on with this thing which I've been putting medicine on it's gotten better already um, and down here, it has got the scar is much better now than where it was. I'm still getting a little bit of itching. It itches quite a bit, so but it's, I don't know if you guys have seen the previous videos of the, uh, the originals. It has gone down a lot, and that was less than three months ago, I guess. What's well, a hundred and All right, so that's what you see there. And actually, it's a little different, but it's healed nicely. It itches like crazy. That's one thing I've noticed. One thing I've noticed about this 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 uh, gel makes it itch like crazy. And I don't, we've tried some different things, and it is not it is not working nicely. So we're trying to get that all figured out still too. So anyway, got a new socket coming. Thought I'd give you that information. The last time I think I told you guys my wife had a stroke and we're uh, dealing with that. During, after they did all the CT scans, they found out that my wife has lung cancer. Uh, they found some stuff on her lungs and did some biopsies on and so she's got lung cancer. Now I'll tell you this, if it hadn't been for a stroke, we wouldn't have found out about lung cancer too late. So we got a shot. 
so it got us good. I don't know. Back to the stroke is one thing, and she's recovering from that, but we got a battle. On the bright side, I'm able to walk again, do what I need to do, and I can take care of take care of things. If this has happened a month before, two months before, it would have been a real bad thing. Um, anyway, God's got a plan. We get it all figured out, and I will update you that. I'm not sure how many updates I will make based on my personal situation going through all this stuff. I will do the best I can to give you updates on myself and my wife as well. Um, this is turning into a, not only an amputation um, amputation journey, but also a cancer journey. So we will um, update you as we as I can. Appreciate you. Talk to you later.